Hi, Theater Mania. I'm Carolee Carmelo. We're here at the Barrow Street Theater talking about our production of Sweeney Todd, the musical. So when you come to the show, you sit at the tables just like you would be at a pie and mash shop, and you eat your pie, and you stay right where you are, and the show happens all around you. I was describing it like it's inescapable theater, because you once you walk in that door, you can't get out. I love it when they actually get scared. Because occasionally, about like once or twice a week, someone will like actually jump or scream, and I'm always like, ha, got him, you know? And that feels good. You know the game of stare? You know, see who blinks first, you know, that whole thing? That's exactly what we're playing. We're playing that game with you. The audience becomes a third character. I mean, no matter what, we have to relate these songs to them and with them. And as a result, that changes our show because you never know how they're going to react. There's a particular moment where uh, we have to have someone move over and I, I intentionally say move. And a lot of people will laugh and they will scoot over. This one woman would not move. She said, no. That's what's so fun, because you never know what you're going to get. When I pass out as Pirelli uh, in the fight, I'm choked and I pass out, I've had people pet my head as I'm like passed out in the seat next to them. People just like to talk to me and make sure I'm okay, which is kind, but, <laughs> but <laughs> I'm supposed to be passed out. <laughs> You're in a pie shop talking about putting people into pies and you, the smell of pie is still in the air. Normally in the theater you have visual and auditory, which are you know the, maybe the most powerful senses, but we've added at least two more in taste and smell. Phil Yoss does an amazing job with the pies. They are so delicious. We like fight over the, the occasional leftovers downstairs. But I think it just really puts you in the time and place and sets you up for this story and what's about to happen. I think it makes the events that unfold all the more real. 